guys, welcome to another reaction video with your boy, the Willow Crafter. And today, we are going to be looking at the actual footage, not animation footage, of Time Traveler from Silver Dollar City. This is the new coaster at Silver Dollar City that just opened very recently. And I'm going to be watching, you know, the off-ride footage that Coaster Force took of it. So, full video credit goes to Coaster Force. And there's also a link in the description if you want to go check out the video. But I'm going to project it right here so you don't really have to. So... Uh, I can't wait to see what this looks like, and actually, one of the real reasons I'm going to be looking at the off-ride footage is simply because I'm going to be building it in April. Yes, spoiler alert, that will be the next coaster I'll be building after Maverick in March. So, you will be seeing Time Traveler being built in April. Actually, here, click the card right here if you want to go see the rest of the coasters that I'm going to be building for 2018, and it's going to be a fire year. So, I'm going to be looking at the off-ride footage just so I get a feeling of what this coaster looks like and what everything looks like because this is basically how the whole process works when I start building a coaster. I look at it in advance, then kind of, you know, analyze it, which supports go where and how the functions work. But I'm a quick blabber right now. I can't wait to see what this looks like because I've heard it looks freaking amazing. It is a hit. It's the first ever spinning coaster to reach your a... 90 degree drop, the first ever launch spinning coaster, and the first one with inversions. What more can you get for right now? But I'm a quick labyrinth, and we're gonna watch this in three, two, one. Time travel at Silver Dollar City. It doesn't really look that steep, but I guess it really is. So let's see, you first go into a dive loop, then a quick little turn, actually a few turnarounds, and then head into the launch. Not actually at the launch, I know you stop there, but eventually it launches you into the next element. It looks like it's gonna come right at me right here. So it stops. Come on. Oh, here we go, so it does launch. So it launches you into an overbank turn. Okay, cool. And then into its vertical loop around. Looks like the dive loop and the launch track. Let's see. It takes you into another set of twisty turns. And a corkscrew. And I believe those are the only few inversions that are on this coaster. And then it takes you into the second launch. For s into another overbank turn. And... Is that it? Looks like that's it. That's the break run over there. <laughs> it's cool to see other people's reactions when they're on the coaster. And I really want to ride this right now. It looks amazing. Alright, so, there you guys have it. There's my little reaction to this coaster. And it looks freaking awesome. I really want to ride this, but I don't know when the next time I'm going to Ohio is. I've never even been to Ohio, so... We'll see what happens. But anyway, you will be seeing this coaster being built by me in Connects in April of 2018. You're going to be seeing Maverick first. Um, Maverick shouldn't take too long, and don't worry. Yes, this time I'm going to finish it, guys. Don't... Don't even worry. So, I will see y'all later. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Zombie Youth are coming. Then, guys, I'll see you next time on the Coaster Crafter channel. Peace!